there's a few times I've been in the studio and I'm like, a song I might be working on gives me goosebumps. You know, that that happens. Um, it was like when I did the, we did Justin Bieber's Where Are You Now? Like something like that. Like just was like, whoa, what the hell are we doing? And then like Lean On for Major Lazer, that was a record that I've probably spent one year on the production, you know? Because I did so many different versions. Like, no, this isn't right now. This isn't what's happening right now. This is, I need to do something. As a producer, my job is to predict the future. Like when I release this record, after I make it, it's gonna take like three months to actually get to the people, you know? Mm. Cause it's like, you need to go with labels, clearing the record. It can't just be like, back in the day I would make an edit and DJ it. And it was like hitting people right up, but my little local neighborhood. But a producer's job is literally like, try to like, at least mine, my forte has always been like, how can I do something that's gonna be big in like six months or like a year, like kind of like being futuristic sounding. Cause that's what the big, that's what the greats have always done. You know, Prince or Timberland or Pharrell, they've always made records that trend set because they were so futuristic. So my, my goal has always been to follow them, never to follow a trend. Mm. 